As we begin calming down to go to bed, my older brother and I talk. It starts with a simple question. Do you want to read and then talk? Or just talk? Or just read? The answer is almost always the same. Just talk. Very sleepily. So when I was younger, I used to visit my dad's old dirty rustic shop. As soon as I saw him, I would jump into his greasy charcoal arms as we exchanged big smiles. It's such a simple thing, nothing but a quick how was your day, but I look forward to it. It calms me. It's one of the only times we bond. And yet, I always end up having to get up in the middle for one reason or another. My grandpa, who would be in his office, would normally be on the phone or writing something down with a pen that spewed ink all over the paper. I either need water or forget my trusty book. And when I come back, he's indefinitely asleep. So I always end up with a book in my hands in the peaceful, dimly lit room. As I waited for him, I would discover things I've never noticed before. Or just draw. When I retire to relax and go to sleep, I always tell my foreign grandma, Good night, grandma. I love you. I always hear back, like a nosht, obi jumte. After what felt like many years, I would finally be able to say, hello. Then, I see the dim light of his, her phone turn off, just like me.
Hold. 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 Together. Hold. Together. Hold. Hold. Longer. Hold. Hold Longer. more. Hold See more. Each other. more. See each other. See the details. See the details. Tell stories. Tell like stories. Like flowers. Plant and watch clouds.